Hey guys, Oblivion234 here again with another Urban Rivals video. Today we're going to be playing some more EFC. Actually, I've, there's a deck that I want to make, but I don't have a card for it. And I'm not going to have that card for a while, and I don't want to buy it. So, hmm. I don't know. You know, let's just go Jorgen here. We can get some good damage in. And then if we have confidence, hmm. Because this will do 6 plus 7, 13. Can't kill him, unfortunately, with that. But. I wouldn't be surprised if he chumps Lola here. That wouldn't be entirely un. Hmm, uh, Frazier. Ow. Okay. Well, we got our pills back. Um, so is this plan just to put me down to one by using Melanie, Clive, Lola? Hmm. Interesting. I'm calling that this is what his plan is. Oh, what do you know? I read you like a book, mate. I don't even have to put one in here. I mean... Going going Lola here is actually kind of pointless, but yeah. He can't put me down low enough, so I'm gonna win. I put him down to one. Thank you very much. Okay. Easy enough of a play there. Too predictable, really. Mm, ghost town, huh? I don't. Know. I do have a stop of ability. Hopefully, I have it. And I don't. Unfortunate. So this is going to be a lot harder of a matchup for me. And I have no good starting people. Hmm. I'll probably start Sarah then. Depends on who he goes. Um. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm going to still start Sarah here. I have a feeling you put six pills in. Or four pills in. Or not. Interesting. Well, now you're poisoned. And I've got confidence, so... I mean... Here you go. 10-7. Um, but yeah, there's a deck I want to make that uses Vortex and... Ooh, tough luck. I think you have lost, sir. Actually, no, he's got John O'Clock. He, he hasn't lost yet. Nope.
Hmm, unfortunate. This is unfortunate. If I tap on an ability, I would almost guarantee myself a victory here. But the fact is, Ennio and John O'Clock by themselves can make such a huge life gap that I, I have to beat one of them. I, there's, I, I can't not beat one of them because if I don't beat one of them, I'm lo I just lo lose, or I, if I lose, guaranteed. So. Mm -hmm. Well, there's no downside to this. Okay. Thing is, he doesn't realize that <laughs> Ennio's uh, on defeat won't trigger because he's dead. If it does, I already, I already sent a thing to Urban Rival support about how that literally screwed me over one game. But yeah, no, that's a knockout. He's dead. Why would you play that that way? You just lose. You There was no need to Fury there. As long as he got through, you won. As long as both got through, you won. There's no reason to Fury. Oh, well. Whatever. I'm not making his choices. <clears throat> so this guy looks like he's playing a mixed deck. Yeah. Mm, this is a bit scary. By bit scary, I mean really scary. He's got a Butcher Braxton, Braxton and a Marshall. Ugh, that's annoying for me to try to deal with. Nope. Let's hope this isn't a bluff. Okay. Well, it wasn't a bluff, but that's decent for us. Best would be go to Sarah to go Sarah, but I don't want him getting Braxton through here. I mean, it's the same this round as next round, but yeah, this is not not looking up for us. I win the tie. Oh, okay, I win the tie. We win then. There's no way he can win. Um, he'd have to. He has to go Oxen here. Okay, let's see, 5 times 4, to 5 times 5 is 35, 35 plus 20 is 55, 8 times that, um, four times 5 plus 15, 35, I think we can just win here. Yep. He's gonna play around. See, that's the thing. He played around me saving Gats. Gats is good, like, any turn after, like, the first two. He, I mean, sure, he's more powerful on the fourth turn, but, I mean, I'm gonna win the game. Day of the box. Ooh. Clint's. Crunchy, I have you. 1,800, sounds reasonable. Battle points and a bronze token. Why is it on Survivor? Okay, this is going decently well for us. I say that and I really shouldn't because then you know I'm just going to lose. Because, yeah. Hey, look. He's running some of what our deck has in it. I have both of those things. I actually own all the CRs and all the legendaries for the Vortex Clan. Um. Yep. I mean. Might as well just Marty. 
It's really no downside to it. He wants to get Galactia through this turn, so she does 8 damage total. But... Interesting. Well, now I've got confidence. Uh, 40, he'd have to be putting in 5. Let's go 50. Ooh, if I want one more. But that's fine, we get pills back. Uh, we go Sarah here. The reason we go Sarah is because Porks loses revenge to Predator anyways. So it's just better to go Sarah. And this way she can... If she gets through, she gets her poison off. Um, if not, we still have revenge for Porks, which is good for us. And we would win the tie with Galactia if he goes Predator here. Yep. We win the tie. Um, unfortunately we don't win this tie, or this, because we don't have revenge. Hmm. Yeah, good game. That was really close. I think if I had gotten through with Naily, maybe I would have, hmm, I don't think so, actually. Yeah, he just had me there, I think. No matter what happened, he realized that if the Predator Fury gets through, he wins, it, uh, but if it doesn't, he has enough pills to win with Galactia anyways. So, yeah, pretty good. If we got, if he didn't have Stop Opponent, hmm. Well, I hope he goes Lynch now. Because, nope. Um... I'm still going Predator here. Okay, that's fine. I don't want to take, I don't want to take seven damage. So, yeah. Um, more likely than not, Lynch is the play here. That's why I pilled so much. Cause even if he pills into Lynch, I'm still gonna beat it and deal seven damage to his face. If not, I have revenge for Porks. Yep, you know he's down to three. He doesn't have confidence for Dakota, so that's not a problem. Okay, seven, eight, nine, ten, uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, if he plays this right, he can win. I mean, I'm gonna do this, like... Yeah. Unfortunate. But, I know, I already knew he won. He didn't pill enough into either of those. Because he can even Fury here. He doesn't need to. He'd win just with not fear without he'd win without fury, but yeah. Mm. I was really hoping I'd be able to save Predator for something like Digging Bill, but I fig I thought he'd probably more in Marshall there at the beginning. He didn't, so Unfortunately, I used to be Pills Predator, and then I didn't have enough to, uh, yeah, do anything else. Okay. Okay. This isn't terrible for us. Um... Actually, uh, Fatagan's a really good counter to Pussycats. Um, 
Olga's a bit scary here. I mean, also, Sarah's a really good counter in Pussycats, because, you know, poison. Mmm. Okay. Um, I don't know what he's going to start here, really. Probably Olga, which is unfortunate because that hurts. Um, well, we're going to put in six and hope that that's enough. Nope. Okay, well, at least we get the majority of those back. I know we'd, we'd want revenge here, but... The poison's more important for us. I mean, we'll be a turn behind on the poison, but the fact that we have it will put us on even footings. Even though we'll be at 9 and he'll be at 13. Then I can go Marty all in. And maybe not Marty all in. Depends on who he, who he goes here. Uh, we win the tie with Noemi. So if he happens to even put over the correct amount of pills in, we still win the tie. He'd have to overpill. Which sucks for him. Um... Brittany's not super good either, yeah. Why would you... Mm, I suppose. Okay. Now he's poisoned. Um, probably no I'm here. Really? Okay. He's one pilling this. No. Well, that sucks for us. I mean, Wait, what? No. I used all my pills, right? Uh, whatever. This game is dumb. I mean, theoretically. Yeah, if it's fine because it works here. One point. Hmm. Well, that was kind of close. But I think we literally just undid everything we just did. One three, lost three. Yeah. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. If you really loved it, subscribe. Oblivion234, out.